The objective within this lesson is to add fractions with sums between 1 and 2. Here I have two fractions, 1 half and 3 fourths. What keeps us from just simply adding is that the units are not the same. And then I can model it for 1 half and model 3 fourths. and then make equivalent fractions. One, two, and three. So my equivalent fraction here is four eighths. Here I had three fourths, drawing one line down the middle, and I have the fraction six eighths. So 1 half plus 3 fourths is equal to 4 eighths plus 6 eighths, which equals 10 eighths. And 10 eighths, I can rewrite as a mixed number. 10 eighths is equal to 8 eighths plus 2 eighths. So that's equal to 1 and 2 eighths. We can also write this as... If we divide by 2 in the numerator and denominator, we can rewrite it as 1 and 1 fourth. Here I have 4 fifths plus 1 half. Let's model 4 fifths first. And then we model 1 half. make equivalent fractions. Four-fifths. Now I have eight-tenths. I had one-half. One, two, three, four, five tenths. So I have four fifths plus one half is equal to eight tenths plus five tenths, which equals thirteen tenths. Thirteen tenths I can rewrite as a mixed number. It breaks down into ten tenths and three tenths, which is one and three tenths. Here's one for you to try. Two thirds plus two fifths. I'm working to get equivalent fractions. Here's two thirds. We had two-thirds, and we're going to fifteenths. Three times five is fifteen. So I have ten fifteenths when I count them out there. Here I had two-fifths, and I separated them now into three equal parts, so that's six fifteenths and I added them together. 10 fifteenths plus 6 fifteenths equaling 16 fifteenths, which equals 1 and 1 fifteenth. Check your work against the screen. We do write the improper fraction as a mixed number. Let's try 3 eighths plus 2 thirds. Model 3 eighths. Three 
and modeling two thirds. making equivalent fractions what I've been doing here is times 3 in the numerator and times 3 in the denominator which is 9 24 and I could count it out from my area model. I had two thirds, and I'm going to go multiplying by eight then. To get sixteen twenty fourths. Nine twenty fourths plus sixteen twenty fourths. The denominator stays the same. 9 and 16 is 25. 25 20 fourths, that's 24 20 fourths, and 1 20 fourth. So my mixed number is 1 and 1 20 fourths. So that's my answer. And showing that work of how I'm getting those. Um, equivalent fractions so that we are able to add to that way our denominator is the same both 20 fourths just like our picture shows so that's how we can make equivalent fractions to be able to add fractions together